Hmm. That knife. Is it still in the cupboard? So this is where it ended up. But why now, of all times? Hmm. Hello, Chloe. Judy. A meteora. Yep. We got yes. a meteora on our hands. Action. Okay. A huge one showing up. A real mother load. Cause for joyous celebration. <laughs> I think you'll be just as pleased, Chloe. You might finally get what you wished for. I might. I'll give you the details later, so hurry up and get over here. If you're late, I'm throwing you into molten steel, and you won't be back. Let me tell you. Julie? Huh? <laughs> oh, a joke about an old movie, you see. Oh, it's such a shame that we've lost all the classics to government censorship nowadays. Damn, this is just predicting future. <laughs> Social level two. So, Chloe, there's something I want you to ask it out on the battlefield. Yeah? <laughs> ask it if Coco tasted good. Wait, this is this big that uh, ate her? That's Coco's? Hmm. Do you hate that meteora, Chloe? As you stare at the one that stole Coco, are you overcome with rage, vexation, and indignation? Yeah, that's the provocation to make, like, you know, emotions in Chloe. I, I get what she's trying to create. My, how fascinating! <sighs> I had designed you to have a weak ego, too. Huh. You've picked up so many emotions over the year. Remarkable growth! I wonder if this is Coco Coconoe's doing. What was her angle, anyway, giving you emotions? Well, there's no way to ask her now. Not after she went and became Meteora Bait. <clears throat> Professor Julie, please, don't taunt her like that. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> she gives such good reactions. I couldn't help myself. Now, while the generation of emotions and designs is a fascinating research topic, Nothing matters now but this big boy. It's so strange though. Why did he eat Coco up? Did eating her influence it in some way? It did. Its thorn wave spatial frequency definitely changed after its consumption. Eating her definitely influenced its information structure. And I just have to wonder what's going on inside there. A party. <sighs> Does it have bones, organs? We don't even know if it's alive or not. It's so wonderful. The mystery of an unknown meteora. A black box. Gods, I just want to tear it apart and get researching. These arms were made for dissection. <sighs> it killed Coco. It stole her away from me. Well, we're going to my ham, seems like it. Chloe, calm down. Calm down? That's the meteora that murdered Coco. I can't forgive. A predator is without sin. What? New character, Dieter. General Dieter! If praying is a sin, then as a species that has preyed upon countless lives, we humans would be unforgivable. Though perhaps... That is why the Meteoras are here. The Meteoras are a trial thrust upon us. Face them with your wits about you. All you need to think about is fighting for humanity. But what's the origin from it? Like, <sighs> where do they oh, come from? My, this is a rare sight. General Dieter, visiting my lab himself. You're always just giving battle advice and never come over to play. A general's role is to give orders. My job is to stay behind the scenes. When a brewing storm comes into view, however, take it alive. This is a rare type of meteora. It holds the key to how our foes work. I trust you will study it if we bring it back, Professor? Oh, I'll study it all right. I'll study every last inch of it. Do you have any 
any idea how bored I've been all this time. They keep escaping my grasp, and the ones that die vanish. Can't study them without samples, and there's nothing worth less than a day without research. <laughs> Once we sell every molecule, every atom, I'll study it all. I'm not letting this one go, ever. If that is your determination, Professor, then I must respond in kind. Only equipment tuned to Meteora capture is permitted for this mission. Remove the very thought of retreat from your minds, no matter how much your Machia suffers. What? That's too risky! I know the risks, but I order you to capture it without destroying it, no matter the cost. Uh... I mean... Uh, now it's kind of like the point that we know that we're creating a personality as a human. A human would not follow the order. Yeah, like independence, obedient, stuff like that. Capture that thing. Alive? That creature killed Coco. You want me to keep it alive? No. No, not that one. Of all the monsters. General Dieter. Chloe's in no shape to deploy. Something's not right about her. Please, let me go alone. You bitch. <laughs> go out alone? That reminds me of your father. But I can hardly say that being recklessly optimistic is befitting of a pilot. Open your eyes. The safety of the city is riding on your lives. But... What's no, this? Uh... A fight? Oh, you humans. Always quarreling. How about you calm down and do some calculations? Calcul. Noah! Ugh. You're kidding me! We've got a huge one on our hands. The meteora that killed my model! Coco Coconoe! I can't imagine how much of a threat it is. It will have to be destroyed with utmost. Noah! This is something I'm always saying, but. No destroying the Meteora! We're taking this one alive! If you kill that Meteora, I swear... How do we capture it? I'm erasing your memory and turning you into a doll. <sighs> that leaves me no real choice then. My fans would be really sad if I died. <laughs> Priorities. Chloe, you stay here. I'll handle this myself. What? Why? This is the meteora that killed Coco. You're not going to be able to hold yourself back. Shut up! No matter what any of you say, that meteora is my enemy. It's the one that killed Coco. And I swear, I'm taking it down with my own hands. This is the reason I went on living in a world without Coco. All for this day. Um, hello? Didn't I tell you to bring it back alive? <laughs> Are you listening? Well, it seems like not. Okay. I'm taking it down with these hands. So I'm assuming there's gonna be a decision then. Ooh, you sound pretty eager. Too eager, in fact. Like someone who's got zero chill, zero calm. I'd love to praise your enthusiasm, but I can't have you killing that meteora. So don't wipe it out, all right? Well, this isn't really your deal to worry about, Chloe. But remember, Noah, you don't want to be <laughs> deleted, right? I know what you want me to do. Don't worry. The only rounds you can use in this mission are high voltage rounds weakened for capture. Hmm. Chloe, I understand how much you hate this thing. But this time, these are orders directly from the general. Disobey and a court martial. But this is Coco's murderer. Oh, good girl, Noah. I'm impressed with your obedience. No deletion for you. Uh huh. All right, Chloe. There's no time. Get going. Don't forget, you're my hunting dog. Come back with your prey in your mouth for me. Or were you going to make Yamato go off on his own? <laughs> That idiot's got a high chance of dying. And he'll let the Meteora escape to boot. <sighs> hmm. Interesting. I'll explain the mission plan. 
Our target is thought to be the Meteora that consumed our comrade two years ago. Its thorn wave patterns and other readings are mostly the same as two years ago, confirming the hypothesis. You will take your regular formation while Chloe moves into sniping range. However, our objective is not the destruction of the target, but neutralization for capture. The rounds you'll be using have been prepared by Professor Julie for this purpose. This concludes the briefing. Oh, hang on! Hmm? So, this Meteora is mostly the same as the one from two years ago. Or, at least, it appears to be. There's something slightly different about it. There's something like a human voice in its waves. God damn it. Uh, like, some sort of song? Something oh like that. God. Anyway, Coco singing. Make sure you keep calm, you two. I'll be praying for your safety. It's gonna be interesting. Hm. Noah! Noah, I'm going to ki- I know, Chloe. I was planning the same thing. Really? You? Chloe, here's the script. Right after the Malkia launch, Art Noah malfunctioned. Stealing from pilot Chloe. She's sacrificing herself? Controls and firing privileges. Unable to do anything, Pilot Chloe only watched as Noah eliminated the Meteora. Uh, I don't like this. That's the log I'll leave. Wait, Noah, why would you... Study that Meteora? Where does Professor Julie intend to keep it? It's going to lead to disaster. There's no way around it. If it gets loose underground, countless people will die. So we need to kill it right here and now. I'm not afraid of getting deleted. Chloe, I understand why you hate me. Anyone would feel that way if a fake version of their best friend showed up. But Chloe, I am your partner. No matter how much you hate me, assisting you is my purpose. You... But listen, Noah. It's great that you've made up your mind, but look. You're not the one pulling the trigger. Chloe... That job lies with... Chloe, you must... I'm going to make the call. But Chloe... God damn it, this is gonna be interesting. If you pull the trigger, we won't be able to cover it. There's no need to cover it up, Noah. This is where my life burns out. <sighs> You'll be the one to avenge her, Chloe. I can tell there's no moving forward for you if you don't. There is no forward for me. That creature is mine. Decisions. It's interesting that uh, maybe that's gonna be like, you know, a split in the endings. Have no idea. <laughs> well, activate the Machia. Let's go. User authentication completed. R2YF Chloe. Oh, oh, damn it. Ship 11, Alto Machia. Surface. Alto Machia. Alto Machia. Communications were cut. Is everything all right? It was an error in the communication system. The system has been restored. <laughs> Problems resolved. All right, Roger. Beginning Machia connection. Activating the Connie links. No problems detected. Put both arms through Makani links. <laughs> connection confirmed. <laughs> Initiating cranial connection. Seems like it's working. Here are the steps to capturing it. Communications error detected. Uh, what? Closing connection. Wait, Noah! <laughs> what the hell are you? Uh uh. Artemis, goddess of the bow, grant my archer your blessing. Arc Noah offers you her song. You. You're the one who. Generator. Convert 
the same pretty much sequence than before. Oh my god, this is the decision. Uh. I do this. <laughs> the enemy has not run out of energy. I can still fight. Chloe, there's another. That's it. I don't know. Oh, finally. <laughs> Oh my god. What? It's a little planet, literally. Oh, uh. Landed. Oh, oh, okay. Huh? What the in the fuck is happening? <laughs> it's an egg. Why? Why does it? Why does it have Coco's face? Oh, this is gonna be a Coco's model as a kind of weapon. You cannot lose your composure. Her appearance does bear many similarities to Coco. That is true. But appearances are nothing but fabrication. She is but a fake. Keep your eyes on what is truly genuine and important, Chloe. That is a meteora. It must be destroyed by your hand. Uh huh? Now is your chance. We have no obligation to wait for it to recover. This is an estimation based on sight. But her external carapace likely has low toughness. A charge of 30% should be enough. You're right. I should pull the trigger. This is Coco's killer. I... Charge complete. Don't think Keep so. If you would. Uh, I... 
Is this Libra? Uh, uh, I don't care if it's a fake. I can't just break something that looks like her. Fine. I am disappointed, Chloe. Yamato, you will be the one to destroy her. If you cut her with your sword now, it should... I don't think it's going to be that easy. An emergency stop signal! Phew, that was close. You almost shattered a valuable research sample! Disobeying orders and purposefully cutting communication. A lot of nerve, you two. Time for some punishment. Ah! Chloe! Professor Julie, what are you doing? No matter how well defined her ego, Chloe is still my creation. And if my dog deigns to shake off her leash and bite me, she'll need some discipline. <laughs> I designed you from the ground up. Yet, there have been impurities in you I had no hand in. And I've always hated that! Uh, uh, uh. So, you two said your prayers? Because it's oblivion for both of you! Is what I would say. But I've still got use for you. Why does the meteora look like that? I didn't expect Coco to have that much influence on it. I don't even know what tricks I'll have to employ to study it. I have a theory that meteora, because it ate her, it kind of like used uh, her to transform into an actual kind of living being, something like that. What? My Coco study. Chloe, her best friend and last person she was with. Noah, an ark made from her mold. No one could be more perfect for the investigation. If you want to keep breathing, you'd better help. Well, not that you have a choice anyway. Hmm. <laughs> uh. So yeah, I entered this uh, Ariadne. I think because things are locked, it might be that yeah, after asleep. some point Sleeping of the storyline, there might be something that changes the storyline or like what happens. I think that's why it's a reference to Ariadne. Ariadne is like a web that connects kind of like things. So maybe that's like why there's like a skip button and then there's gonna be like decision and different maybe like personality based things. Yeah, this game seems com to be complex. I wonder what's gonna happen in the first playthrough because I'm pretty sure there's gonna be few playthroughs just like in Tokyo Chronos. So we'll have to see.